Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to iTouch App Reviewers. In this video, I have a quick app review of Float for the iPhone and iPod Touch. I want to thank the developers for sending us out a promo code to review this. And let's let it load up here. Some, sometimes I think you have to tap this to get it to load. There we go. So, it has pretty nice music and an interactive start menu here. So it's got Open Faint and Facebook Connect, High Scores, Options, Extras, and Play. So let's go right into play. So you got normal mode, time mode, zen mode. Uh, you can buy limbo mode. Uh, oops. Uh, and then you can buy hot potato mode. Uh, one and done. You can uh, buy. And then helium pack coming soon. Uh, I believe that that will be free. And I think they might be making these free. I'm not completely certain on that. But I think that they are. So anyways, you got normal mode here, and uh, what happens is a balloon comes down, and you want to keep it up in the air without letting it hit these spikes down here. This is the bonus area, because obviously it's risky uh, having balloons there, uh, and you get more points for that. Now, I'm sure all of you have played this game before uh, in real life, you know, where you have a balloon, you don't let it touch the ground. But this one actually gives you a gratuitous amount of points for it. As you can see, my, t my best score is only 1 million, but, uh, you know. You got 30 seconds, uh, usually, about average, maybe, per round uh, for this. And you're going to want to get the most points you can. If you tap outside of the bonus area, at least I know in the time attack mode, which I'll show you in a second, uh, if you tap them while they're outside of the bonus area, you lose that combo that you had going. So I just learned not to tap them unless they're in the bonus area. And I got 71,000 points already, so as you can see, you get a ton of points for this. And it really makes you feel, you know, accomplished and things when you get a really high score. So those are your lives up at the top each round, like I said, an average of about 20 or 30 seconds per. And it gets harder and harder as you go along, but after each round, you know, you're like, okay, three, two, one. And I lost two because I wasn't paying much attention. I was looking at the clock. But that's how the game rolls from uh, normal mode. Let's go uh, change mode. Yes. Go back to time mode. has a very nice um, sound effect. So as you can see, you know, 1x, 2x, and if you tap outside the bonus area, it goes away. The bonus area gets smaller as you just saw it move, hopefully. So you can just rack up a bunch of points while they're, you know, times 6, times 7. So I just tapped outside of the bonus area, so that wasn't good. And that is basically the time attack mode. It's a lot of fun and can get kind of intense with the sound the sound effects on this sound really good and stuff like that. So if you're looking for a game with good sound, this definitely has it. It's got pretty realistic sound. Lastly, you've got Zen mode. Yeah, this mode is basically self-explanatory. You don't really have to do anything, you just tap these as many times. And well yeah, you gotta be gentle, not you know break the balloons, but you try to get as many taps as you can, and you've got unlimited time, and everything like that. You can let them fall, more just come, and yeah, that's pretty much it. I had 400 or something, but I was testing something, and I probably shouldn't have. Uh, I exited the app, and just wanted to see if it had backgrounding uh, for it, multitasking, whatever you want to call it, and it doesn't, so I lost about 400 there, so that was kind of bad, but anyways, I like to just pop them sometimes. Anyways, when you're done, you just click um, Nirvana and you, are you zened out? Yes. And it says, good job. And I got four, 45. So, that is Float for the iPhone and iPod Touch. More modes coming soon, as it said. And I think some of them are going to be free. So go check this app out. It's a lot of fun. It's a good casual game to play. Fun for the whole family, basically. Uh, you can Anyone would like this game, I think. That's a lot of fun. So go check it out. I'll see you guys in the next one. Link down in the description of this app. And that's about it. Don't forget to subscribe and like this video. See you in the next one. Peace.